Welcome to our video of installation rules part 18 of paper 1. Special installations or location section 7.11, a very short presentation or video on safety and emergency lighting. Safety and emergency lighting. Normal safety and emergency lighting systems shall be independent of outdoor lighting systems. The electrical equipment of an emergency lighting system shall be independent of the electrical equipment and circuit of the normal lighting system. Normal and safety lighting systems may share a source of supply, but an emergency lighting system shall have an independent source of supply. If the source of supply uses batteries that emit explosive fumes or gases, or both, it shall be installed in a room that is designed to accommodate the source of supply and the batteries, has adequate ventilation to the outside, and when required, CSANS 10108 contains explosion proof electrical systems. Where the emergency supply is provided from a central power system, an emergency lighting supply circuit shall have a clearly identified manual control for use if the automatic control fails to operate. All controls of emergency lighting shall be inaccessible to the general public. Exit signs shall be illuminated by the safety and emergency lighting systems. An exit sign or an emergency luminaire that contains its own battery shall have continuous supply to the battery charging equipment. That brings us to the end of this very short video. Please click on the playlist to see the rest of the videos in the series, as well as subscribe our, to our channel and like our videos to be updated on the latest content. Thank you very much for viewing with us and good luck with the exams.